hey guys welcome or welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'm going to be doing a reading y'all's assumptions about milo and i and i'm going to be like reacting to them saying if they're true or false as well as answering some questions <laughs> if you can't already tell um and so if you hear like cars or any outside noises that is why i have all of my questions and assumptions on this list so yeah let's just get into it so first i'm going to be starting off with the assumptions wind chime up there and it's really loud so i'm sorry about that okay so the first assumption says from what I've seen, you guys have a good bond. Yes, I would consider that true. I would say we do have a good bond. Okay, the second assumption says you and Milo have a great bond. Um, I would say we have a good bond. I wouldn't say it's like great. The next one says I assume he gets really happy to see you when you go to the barn. He doesn't like get mad when I go catch him because I give him treats. <laughs> um, so I don't know if he gets like really happy, but I would say he probably gets like happy to see me because I give him treats. The next one says magnificence. Um, if you're saying like me and Milo are magnificent, thank you so much. Okay, the next one says, I think you and Milo are amazing together. Thank you so much. The next one says, you and Milo are so cute together. <laughs> thank you. This one says, he's handsome. Yes, I would say that is true. He's definitely a really beautiful horse. Those are all of the assumptions I got, so now I'm going to be answering the questions that I got on YouTube. So this one girl asked, like, questions. Oh, I already answered them all in the comments, but if I just wanted to um, answer them also in a video just because, like, I don't know if y'all are wondering the same things. So, yeah. The first question says how many horses do you own um, i don't own any horses and i never have i have leased two horses in my life um the first one i ever leased his name was rusty and he is featured in my channel and i lease milo right now so yeah next question is are you ever going to get your own horse or horses definitely when i'm older i'm going to have horses but as of right now i don't plan on getting a horse anytime soon you know that would be literally a dream come true but uh, it's like really expensive. I'm just like not allowed right now, so but I am super duper grateful for Milo and the chance to lease such an such an amazing horse. So yeah. So the next question is do you keep your lease horse at your place? I don't live at a barn, um, but I go to a barn and Milo lives there. The next question is how many horses are at the barn? I think there's around like 14 horses. Okay, next question. I love you. Can you do a meet my loose horse, please? I love you too. And yes, I actually plan on doing that soon. Okay, the next question is can you also do a meet the other horses too? I don't know. I might be able to do that. I don't know though. Okay, the next question is when is your next horse show? I actually don't do horse shows, but I plan on getting evaluated at a show barn in a few months once I get back into the hang of things. I want to do shows this year. I, I think I'm going to do shows this year, um, but yeah. So I did actually answer this question in the comments, so she had like follow-up questions, so that's what these questions are. So she said, if you do shows, are you going to ride your lease horse? Milo actually gets really nervous at shows, so I wouldn't want to like freak him out, so no. So will you ride one of the horses at the barn that your lease horse is at? So since I will be getting like evaluated at a show barn, I will be going to like a different barn to like train for horse shows and stuff. I will still be going to my barn. I would just like train at another barn and like do shows you know for that barn no i won't be riding any of the other horses at my barn but if i do shows for like my barn that i'm at now then yes i will ride a horse at my barn 
So now these are the questions on Instagram and there's only two so those are the last questions I have. The first question is what happened and this was on like my concussion post when I talked about my concussion. So basically what happened is um, I got bucked off of Milo and I got a concussion. I talked about it in my updates where have I been video which is like a recent video so if you want to know like the whole story you can go check out that video Some great news I'm actually cleared finally um, I got cleared on Valentine's Day so yeah I can ride again which is super exciting okay and then this is the last question that I have wow you and your horse are beautiful together keep up your amazing work just for my personal curiosity what breed is your horse Okay, first of all, thank you so much. That is literally so sweet. Um, and Milo is an appendix. Thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you if you um, wrote an assumption. And thank you for asking questions. Thank you for these sweet assumptions and questions. I really, really appreciate it. Um, you guys truly make my day. And I love you all so much. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye. I've been searching for a trail to follow. Again, take me back